interview stage after, just to wrap that up, at the end of the interview, first, almost after the interview, always have two to three uh, questions, no less, no more. And one of those questions should be, what are the next steps? In other words, who calls whom or emails whom by when? If you don't know that, if you don't have agreed on that, you, I mean, we get these questions a lot. So when should I follow? I've had an interview three weeks ago. Uh, when should I follow up for feedback? Well, then we ask as career consultants, what did you agree on with your interview? Oh, nothing. <laughs> So help yourself and agree on next steps. Who contacts whom, how, what's the channel, and by when. Send a thank you email with a summary of your call within 24 hours. Follow up three to seven days after the agreed deadline. So do give them a little bit of space. And if then there's nothing, follow up after another 14 days. And if then there's nothing which does happen, and I hear your frustration when recruiters ghost you, get in touch with somebody else from the organization if you had contact with them. Um, another tip, make a summary of the interview for your own records. Um, why? Once you have more than five interviews, you'll start mixing up companies and confusing people. And I do hope that all of you will have that problem soon. Um, so this is um, how we recommend um, our clients keep notes. Um, so you make a note on the interview style, on a scale from one to ten. How, how do you assess yourself, how the interview went, any weird, challenging, interesting questions, key things you discussed, information you obtained, the next steps we agreed on. Then you have a checklist, uh, send a thank you email, send additional documents, send uh, references, connect connect with that person on one of the social platforms, um, et cetera, et cetera. Hi, you have just watched a little fragment of all the know-how at Career Angels that goes into finding the best possible job. We have decided to put our know-how into one very thorough and structured course that is now available on Udemy. In that course, we will walk you through all four steps of the job hunting process. Step number one is about goal setting, realistic goal setting. We will explain career management theory backed by research, as well as walk you through the parameter bidding exercise. Step number two is about your unique selling proposition. In other words, how you position yourself on the current job market. Step number three is about communicating that in your CV, your CV for applicant tracking systems and your optimized LinkedIn profile. Step number four, the last step, is about managing and navigating the job hunting channels, meaning how to network, how to apply to job ads, how to contact headhunters, and how to contact and reach out to decision makers at the companies you would like to work for. So in summary, the course is very thorough, explains all our methodology, and is now available on Udemy. Summarizing, our course on Udemy walks you through the four steps of the job search process. Why did we decide to publish it? We did that so that your own job search becomes less frustrating, faster and more effective. If you'd like to check it out, find the link down there in the description.